Grace Covenant Church finds its home in Cornelius, North Carolina, a city with a rich 80-year history of advancement and growth. In the year 1938, long before Lake Norman came to town, the holy waters of baptism were poured out under a tent in a revival led by the late Dr. and Mrs. Clanton. What was meant to last two weeks lasted five weeks, and soon a building took shape as the calloused hands of church members provided the labor. Money was tight, but God used what the people gave and he multiplied it. The church was expanded and even the next generation, children of the new converts under the tent began singing songs about Jesus instead in a concrete basement. And it was on that easel of brick veneer and musty carpet that God planted a church that you and I now call home. In the year 1998, people doubled down on their decision not to limit God and a brand new sanctuary and a balcony and even multiple expansions would ensue. New campuses were launched in East Lincoln and in Mooresville. And now, Grace Covenant Church is embarking on one of our most significant moments yet. Because while COVID certainly changed things like inflation and higher interest rates and unrelenting construction prices and perhaps even what your family argues about at Thanksgiving dinner, COVID did not change the status of lost people around Lake Norman. So we are inviting everyone who calls Grace home into a two-year season that we are praying will be like no other. Our predecessors demonstrated bold faith in hoisting sail toward the unknown, and we must continue to have faith beyond the buoys. We must make gritty and innovative decisions to raise our children and grandchildren in the love of Jesus and in the safety of the local church. Yes, our times are uncertain, but one thing I've never been sure of is that the world needs Jesus. Welcome to Uncharted.